Hi, I'm Philip Greenspun. The challenge for today is making phone calls with the Samsung Galaxy Note phone. We've set this phone up so that it shows only contacts with phone numbers. Okay, let's call my friend Paul. This should be pretty easy because Paul was the last person to call me. What if we were to search for him in the contact manager? Type in Paul. Okay, what's the first result? Alan Paul. I guess we could try to call him. Oh, we can't because there's no phone number on file for this person. Perhaps he emailed me several years ago and I responded to him in Gmail and now he becomes a full-fledged Samsung contact. Chris Pulse, no phone number. David Paul Photography, no phone number. Harrison Paul, no phone number. None of these people have a phone number. How about Neil Lesh? There's a little phone icon, maybe he has a phone number. Is his name Paul? No. Did his name used to be Paul? No. Is there a Paul in his email address? No. A Paul in his address? No. There is St. Paul Street, though, in the directions to his house. We can scroll all the way down about four screens until we find Paul Cantrell, an excellent helicopter instructor at East Coast Aero Club, and there's a phone number on file for him, but he's not one of my most frequently contacted people. So it would take quite a few street screens to get to Paul Whitmore, the most recent Paul who called me. That is why it's time to buy an iPhone.